What's up guys, it's Becca from Pretty in Picos here and today I thought I would do a video kind of explaining how I got rid of my body acne. I'm sure if you guys are acne sufferers, you guys have also gotten some spots on your body like your back, your shoulders, your chest, um, areas like that. I definitely have recently developed more back acne and I've developed more acne on my chest as well since I've been working out a lot more at the gym. So I definitely wanted to do a little video to kind of share with you guys what I've been doing to kind of back my acne on my body to kind of share the tips and the tricks that I've been doing that have been working for me so far so yeah let's get into it okay so before I start anything the very first thing I want to say is that um, I started treating my body acne like my face acne and once I started doing that I kind of saw a change in my body acne um, it was less painful less red if I did get like a breakout, it wouldn't be as bad as it usually had been. So that kind of happened once I started treating my body acne the same way that I treat the acne that I get on my face. So I think this is pretty important because you're usually experiencing body acne for similar reasons that you do on your face. It could be due to not washing that area as well as you should. It could be due to the sweat and bacteria that get in your pores um, in your body, or it could be due to hormones. Mine's kind of like a mixture of all of them, but you could definitely have body acne for several different reasons. So once I kind of started treating my body acne the way I treat my face acne, you definitely could see a change in everything about my body acne. So I kind of pamper the rest of my body the same way that I do my face and kind of treating it with the same kindness and respect that I did um, for the skin on my face. So something else that I was doing was that I changed my body wash. Um, so as you guys know, I've said this in other videos before, I kind of started to go more towards the natural side, but my body wash was kind of like one of the last things that I changed, which seems, it seems kind of silly, but it's true. It took me like kind of a while to find a body wash I actually really liked. The brand that I'm using right now is from Target. I believe it's just the Method brand. It's just their basic body wash. Um, I have several different like smells. But yeah, I've been using the one from Target um, from Method. That's the body wash I've been using on my body. I don't use any like acne scrubbing I, body washes or I don't use anything with too harsh ingredients. I kind of wanted to just make sure my skin was smooth, my skin was calm, it wasn't irritated or red. Um, I wanted to make sure that my body was clean, that it smelled fresh, um, and most importantly, I wanted to make sure that I got the bacteria off um, from going to the gym, like sweating, um, any oils that my skin produces. Um, I just wanted to make sure I got a body wash that left my skin completely clean. You can use one with scrubby, like little beads in it, or you could just do like a plain body wash. I would do both. Um, I do have like more of an exfoliating kind of body wash that I use like once or twice a week that I will exfoliate my body with, but I do have just like a regular wash that I use every day. So the third thing that I have been doing is that I've been changing my sheets like more frequently. Um, I know this is kind of, some people say it's a myth, some people say that they wash your sheets every week, once a day whatever the case may be. Whatever I was doing before, I started just doing more of that. So I washed my sheets more often, I changed my pillowcases more often. I wanted to make sure that the um, fabric that I was putting my skin against when I went to bed, um, I wanted to make sure that was clean and fresh um, and there wasn't any bacteria, there wasn't any dirt, um, any oils left over from the nights before. So I know I'm not doing anything crazy like washing my sheets like once a day. I have heard of people doing that and if that works for you or if you have time to do that, you definitely could do that. I don't see the harm in that. But for people like me who go to school, they have a job, stuff like that, washing your sheets once a week instead of like every couple of weeks or once a month definitely helped me big time with my body acne. I saw a lot of reduction in the acne I was getting on my back. So the fourth thing that I decided to do to help with my body acne is going back into the shower. So instead of just using like a regular loofah um, that I use on the rest of my body, I actually bought a body brush. So it's just like a long brush with like either bristles on it or it has a loofah on it. Um, you can put soap on there and you can actually like reach behind your back. So it's able to help me kind of reach the areas that I couldn't reach like by myself when I was in the shower. I could reach the back, uh, the middle of my back, my shoulders, uh, my lower back, my middle back as well. Um, and I didn't have to worry about just rinsing it off and kind of reaching where I could. I could actually get my entire back all soapy. So buying a body brush was like super awesome. Um, I definitely recommend anybody to buy a body brush. It just kind of helps make sure you get extra clean. Body brushes are definitely 
Now, one of my favorite things to use, it like kind of feels like a massage for your back. I definitely love using it and I definitely saw an improvement in my acne on my back. Okay, and the last thing that I started to do um, to help with my body acne is I actually started masking on my back. Um, so just like I said in the beginning of the video, um, I was taking the time to take care of my body skin just like I was taking care of uh, my facial skin. So once I kind of started doing that, I did um, moisturizers on my back, I did toners on my back, um, and I did masking on my back as well. So you definitely could use like Banish has a charcoal mask. Um, that I've been using on my back a lot recently um, just on the blemishes you can use it as a spot treatment or you can kind of just do all your shoulders you can do um, your arms your chest um, you can even do your armpits as well to kind of detoxify your skin it really helps to pull like the impurities out um, so kind of help like diminish my acne like um, as soon as I got it, it helped to pull the bacteria out it kind of helped to calm and soothe my acne as well because nobody knows more pain than a girl wearing a bra and they have like a pimple or like a blemish like right under their bra strap i cannot tell you like how painful that is because like like your bra is pulling down on the straps um, for support and so when it pulls like on top of like a pimple it is seriously so painful so i started masking on my back and it really helped to kind of like keep those from being like super irritated it really helped me in the long run just um, because my acne would go away like faster than it would before and once i kind of started pampering my skin it definitely changed my skin game like totally because i started seeing less acne my skin was looking more healthy it was looking more moisturized i was using moisturizers and i was using masks and i was using toners and stuff that I would use like on my face. I was getting help from my mom or I was getting help from my fiance. I was having them help me put masks and stuff on my back or uh, on my body where I couldn't reach. And then I kind of just did the exact same thing as my routine for my face. But instead of using like my face moisturizer, I would just use like a really nice lotion. So I've been using like the Body Shop Body Butter Lotions. Um, those are definitely my favorite and they kick, like they have like a really good moisturizer level um they're super moisturizing they are an all-natural skincare company as well um, of course i used to work for them so i have like a million body butters but that's um the moisturizer that i choose to use on my own body but just treating my skin the way i was treating um, the skin on my face i definitely started seeing like a huge improvement um on my back acne all right so that's pretty much it for me i know this is kind of like a more shorter video um but i kind of just want to get this out here um and kind of tell you guys the stuff that i've been doing because I know summer is coming up and I cannot wait to wear like those super cute strapless dresses and I have a wedding coming up in fall. I'm gonna do like a whole nother video and like little segment on that um, to kind of talk about how I'm keeping my skin like good for my wedding. Um, but I definitely have uh, a dress that has like a see-through back. You can see my shoulders and stuff like that. So I kind of wanted to jump on the ball and get you guys going with me. So. Thank you for bearing with me. I know it was kind of more of a shorter video. I just wanted to give you guys an opportunity to kind of start um, treating your body skin like your face skin um, so you can get prepared for summer and so you can wear those cute strapless little dresses and not have to worry about any blemishes or acne on your back. So thank you guys so much for watching and make sure you subscribe to the Acne channel and hit that bell notification button so you'll be notified anytime we post a new video. Alright guys, that's it for me. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.